Let's go over a couple of tips and tricks when setting up a scene in Daz Studio. First, what I want to do is to come up to this menu right here. I'm going to turn on the floor and I don't really need to see the aspect right now until we're rendering. And I'm going to turn off the center axis as well. Make sure you go over all these different options. I'm going to go ahead and apply this character into my scene. What I'm going to do is hold down Alt while I drag, and then I can drop him anywhere in the scene. This is really useful if you're setting up a scene with multiple characters, multiple props, and you can see over here in the parameters pane exactly where he is in the scene. Again, I'm gonna hold down Alt and I'm just gonna click on these values, and this will reset them to zero. And you can see as you do manipulate any parameter, it will highlight in white rather than that dark gray. So let's go back out. And what I want to do, I want to give him a prop. So let's go into the props. I'm going to grab this left hand rifle. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to drag over and hover over his left hand until this dialog box pops up and I'm going to select parent to left hand. So automatically he's going to hold that rifle and it's going to be parented to his hand. This doesn't work with every prop and every character, just if they're compatible together. So let's go back out and let's say I want to add another figure into my scene and notice that he's selected right here. Let's say if I wanted to add Liam in, I double click and it's going to bring up this dialog box. We can either load him in as a new character or just apply him to the character that's already in the scene. If we do that, you see our character is going to change. We don't want to do that. Uh, let's go out and let's get a bad guy. So let's make sure he's not selected. Alt, drag, and drop him into our scene. 